Okay, don't mind me. I'm just gonna wander over here to the bathroom and have diarrhea. Bro, please. What's up guys? Oh, you guys are over here. My name is Bleep, and tonight we're playing a fan-made game of FNAF called Shadows Awaken. Hope you guys enjoy. You are about to play a horror game that contains flashing lights, loud noises, and unsettling visual content. Please refrain from playing if you believe these elements may negatively affect you. <laughs> Joke's on you, buddy. Nothing affects me anymore. I am dead inside. This is an early access demo. Content shown is subject to change or removal in future updates. Sweet. I have no idea what I'm getting myself into as per usual. I just know it's like a free roam FNAF type style game that was apparently influenced by uh, Silent Hill PT, that game that was supposed to come out years ago. I don't even know much about it. I just heard it had a lot of hype around it and then it never released and it kind of uh, made some people upsetty spaghetti. Press space to proceed. Sweet, let's do it. Um, hello? It's been years. Oh, I also think that this was after the events, the bite of 87, after the bite of 87. I'm not sure what that is. Maybe that was like the first attack. I've only ever played the first one. And then beyond that, I'm not sure. Michael, what? Your eyes, they're getting dull. The old power, the sight that cuts through reality. What are you talking about? You've seen them before, haven't you? The shadows, the whispers in the dark. My eyes, there are things unseen from most, yet you see their shade. The shadows hide in the dark, but your eyes, they cut through it. They always have. It's becoming weak. What do you want from me? Why are you telling me this? A light. Your eyes need the light. Who's talking to me? I guess I'm Michael, but who's the, this other person? Uh, a light? Remember why you fear the dark, Michael. Okay, watch out. The darkness. It breathes, it watches, it waits. Beware of what lurks within. Sounds good. Just give me a task list and let me knock out some tasks. Usually what I uh, excel at. You just give me a couple simple objectives that a simple-minded fellow like myself could follow. We'll be good. I feel like I'm walking like an animatronic. What? What? I don't know. I'm not sure, man. I just showed up. Objective has been updated. Press escape to view the menu panel. Begin the chapter by finding the Freddy plushie. All right, sounds cool to me. Thank you for tuning into this broadcast. No problem. We have some breaking news to share. I'm all ears. Five missing children have been discovered deceased. You don't say. And the individual suspected of the crimes is currently unaccounted for. Okay. This gruesome act of homicide occurred at the former location of Freddy Fazbear's Pizza. Oh. During the incident, the assailant used a meat cleaver to claim their first victim. When law enforcement arrived at the scene, they found a young girl who had their mouth wide open as if her jaw had been totally separated from her skull. Several months prior to these tragic murders, a distressing event unfolded at Fredbear's family diner. Reports indicate that one of the animatronics from the diner inflicted fatal injuries upon a child, who was subsequently identified as the perpetrator's own offspring. The incident occurred while a group of children were engaged in play. Interestingly, the victim's older brother, who presently manages the establishment, was among those present. State police have expressed that the heinous homicide seemed to be connected to the incident that transpired a few months earlier. Following the revelation that the company's owner was responsible for the murders, the owner went missing, leaving his eldest son in charge of the company. Alright, cool. Listen, man, I'm just here to find a plushie, okay? That's all. Ah, oh, man, I used to have these stars when I was a kid, except they were... Stuck on my wall. They weren't hanging from the ceiling. Brings back such fond memories. Such fond memories of joy and not crippling depression. I'm just playing. I'm not depressed at all. Actually, I'm a very happy guy. I try to be a happy guy. Not always a happy guy, but I certainly try to be. Oh, wait, was this? This kind of looks like one of the levels in FNAF, no? I don't know. I've never played beyond FNAF 1, so I'm not sure if, uh... I'm not sure. Like, I'm not sure how much I'll be able to recognize as like like stuff playing on the other titles you know like easter eggs and and stuff like that or not necessarily easter eggs but uh you know like hints and like what's what i'm looking for like homage to the other titles you know what i'm saying like stuff that that does this among titles among game titles i have no idea what i'm trying to say you guys know what i'm trying to say though actually i do know what i'm trying to say i just don't know how to say it which is a very common theme on this channel man it's kind of annoying that i can't run already right off the bat can't move too fast which is not ideal in a game wherein I believe I'm going to be chased. 
All right. Chapter one, the centipede. Objective has been updated, press escape. All right, find a flashlight. Nice, can I find some sprint too while I'm at it? I am going to assume that the flashlight is downstairs. Here we go. All right, all right. What's all this about? Is this my workstation? Is that a man on an elephant? Nothing too out of the ordinary. Just about as ordinary as we like it. Man, I really need to get this place fixed up. I have let this place go to shambles. This game looks pretty good, I gotta say. It does look pretty good. Hey, here we go. Random flashlight in a dark, pitch dark bathroom. Perfect, okay. You found a flashlight. The item is useful for illuminating dark areas that lack a light source. No way. Press E to toggle the flashlight on and off. Yeah, all right. Cool. Will do. Okay, that flashlight animation is way too much. Look at this. That is way too much. He's doing way too... He's doing way too much with that flashlight. Wait, what is this? Oh, a light bulb. Oh, okay, a light bulb. This can be used to replace the bulbs and broken wall lamps, restoring them to full functionality. Keep an eye out for any damaged lamps as you explore. Repairing them could be key to illuminating dark areas. Okay, so I guess I need to stay in the light. I guess. Oh my goodness, this takes a quite a long time. That is a minute. Almost as long as it takes for me to turn on and off my flashlight. Okay, so apparently all we needed to do to unlock that door was replace the flashlight. Replace the light bulb. All right, what am I doing now? What's the objective? Find interactable paper drawings. Paper drawings, I'm going to assume, would either be in a... on a refrigerator or in a bedroom. Let's go check the fridge. Nope, looking pretty boring. Looking pretty ordinary. That's how we like it though. We actually strive for ordinary on this channel. We don't even strive for it, we just achieve it naturally. Focus, focus, focus. Holding down space puts the player into a focus state, sharpening their hearing and allowing them to detect sounds beyond the physical world. The longer you focus, the louder these sounds become. So take your time when tuning in. The direction you're facing is crucial. Ensure you're oriented toward the area you want to concentrate on. Keep in mind the player remains immobile during this state, so choose your moments wisely. Follow the music. This way, right? That's pretty. Oh, that's pretty music. I like that. Oh, wait, it may be upstairs. It's probably upstairs in this dark room. Let me hone my senses real quick. Yep, affirmative. Man, I wish I could just trot even. Don't even give me a sprint, I'll just trot. <coughs> it was not in the bedroom. Is it back in the bathroom? Oh, we might be on to something. Hang on just a minute. Look for interactable paper drawings throughout the map. They serve as a guide and help you progress the game. Okay, we need paper drawings. Just a couple pieces of paper with some drawings on it. Oh, wait, I see some drawings. Hang on a second. Oh, we're on to something. We're on to something big. We're on to something very big. Feel the progress being made, and oh my goodness, it feels so great. You are the what? Oh, you are now safe in the dark. You are now safe? You're not safe. Oh, you're not safe in the dark. The player's anxiety level gradually rises with prolonged exposure to darkness, creating a sense of escalating tension. However, staying near a light source helps calm the player, reducing anxiety over the over time. The heart icon serves as a visual cue for anxiety with the icon becoming more visible as the anxiety increases and fading out as it decreases, offering a clear indication of the player's current state Sounds great. Find interactable paper drawings. I don't think anybody could have seen that one coming. Do I sell my flashlight? I sure do.
Repel. Find a camera. All right, I can do that. I bet I know where a camera might be. In my office. I'm doing this for the thumbnail. The centipede often tries to block your path and catch you off guard when entering rooms to stay safe, avoid getting too close, and maintain a safe distance from the anomaly. Yep. 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 That was probably not the smartest thing in the world. I was just trying to get to my office behind Fredward. Well, it's not even Fredward, it's the centipede. Okay, round two. Oh, centipede. Hey, buddy. All right, we need to stay in the light because our heart is not looking too great right now. Let's get in the light, shall we? Perfect. Perfect. You're kind of rude, man. All right, let's go this way. Let's go the way that we originally wanted to go anyway. Maybe he's not here anymore. Nice. Find a camera. Find a camera. All right, let's go to our office. Let's go to our office and see if we can find a camera in our office. Let's check upstairs. Man, why can't I run? Even if I could run just a smidge, not even run. If I can mall walk. If I had mall walking speed, man, we would have already had this game wrapped up. Do, 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 up, up, up. Oh. <laughs> this guy. So I wonder if you like look at him directly, does he kill you? Like if I look at him directly right now, if I turn around right now and look at Centipede, does he get me? Whoop. Nah, he ain't too bad. Okay, he's not that bad. The problem though is he does, oh my gosh, he looks so menacing. That's crazy. He does look, he, he's not the worst enemy I've, I can't. What am I? Oh man, words are tough at this ripe old age of 32. Let me just scoot right back in my room with my stars. Thank you very much. Shut that door. Oh, nope. No, I'm outside with centipede. I don't want that. Okay. Perfect. Man, you are still here. How are you here and upstairs at the same time? You're impressive, man. You are. Oh, maybe you're not here anymore. If you're still in here, then I'm convinced there's three of you. Perfect. Nothing in here. Nope. Let's shut that back. Cool. Here's a camera right where I thought it'd be all along. Okay, you found a camera. You found a camera. Press Q to equip or unequip. Hold right mouse button to release a bright flash, which can illuminate dark areas and repel the centipede. Cool. How do I do it again? Repel Freddy. Wait, I thought it was a centipede. I don't know what's going on. Oh, I gotta hold it. I gotta hold the mouse button. Okay, so I'm just supposed to repel Freddy. Okay, we can do that. Ooh, that's that's a cool mechanic. I like that. That has just enough spooky to it. Have more lights gone out? It is so dark in here. And I really need to invest in some bulbs. Can I just get like his hand? Nice. I love that. Okay, so I don't have to look at him directly. Okay, let's see what this says. Find interactable paper drawings. And we are doing so great. We are making strides. Oh! What I was gonna say before. What I was gonna say before was this game is just a demo. It's just a demo and I found it on Game Jolt from the YouTuber 3FS. I follow his channel. He's a really cool guy and uh, I like his stuff. Here's through the darkness. What you mean by that? Focused flash method. While focusing and after maintaining focus long enough, use your camera's flash while focusing to reveal unseen figures or threats, allowing you to pinpoint their location. Keep in mind that the longer you focus, the sharper your senses become. Take your time to reach full focus for maximum effectiveness before using the flash. However, be cautious. Each use of a focused flash slightly increases your anxiety level. Follow my voice. Follow the, uh, follow the voice. Use the focus flash method, I think is what it said. So I need to have my camera out. Let's focus and then let's flash. Nothing? Okay. Okay, let's try it in here. Oh, it is so dark in there. Holy moly. Okay, well, we got to do it. We got to go in. Okay, maybe in here. Maybe in here. Yeah, definitely in here. Yeah, the ghost has moved location, follow the voice. Oh, okay. Warning, a threat has made its move. It can go invisible at times, watch out. What you mean by that? A threat has made its move, what you mean by that? 
What kind of threat are we talking about here, huh? Oh my good golly. Oh my good gracious golly. That was very scary. I didn't like that one bit. I'll tell you that right now. I am not here for that. I did not like that one bit. Oh my gosh. All right, the ghost has moved, follow the voice. Okay, I need light though. This is not great. Uh, can I leave? Oh, there we go, I just had to get really close to it. Oh my golly. Oh my gosh, I can't see crap. Oh my gosh, I can't see anything, I'm gonna go crazy. I need this light desperately. All right, let's do some flashing. Let's check back here. Okay, well, Freddy is in the kitchen. Let's not stay in the kitchen. Okay, don't mind me. I'm just gonna wander over here to the bathroom and have diarrhea. Bro, please. <laughs> oh! All right, that's fine. Oh, dude, we're back here. But wait, I don't have the camera. Wait a minute, I don't have the camera. We gotta run it again. Let's just blow through this real quick. Yeah, so I tried to, uh, I tried to play this game twice. Tried to, uh, tried to reset it. And then went to the main menu, came back and uh, still couldn't pull out my, my camera or my uh, flashlight for the life of me. Literally, I need them to survive. Uh, hey buddy. A threat has been made, it's uh, has made, has made us move. It can go invisible at times, watch out. Uh, all right, that's fine. So, okay. Okay, the ghost, wait, wait, is he still there? He's not there anymore. Okay. 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 Should I just flash the whole time? I, th I feel like. Flash it! <laughs> Woo! All right, that one's on me, kind of, but not really. I he wasn't he wasn't even in the kitchen anymore. So what? How does that make sense? I checked and I and I double checked. I flashed multiple times. I flashed. These jump scares are brutal. These jump scares act. These jump scares physically hurt my body. As a 32-year-old man, 32-year-old father, 32-year-old, out of shape. Okay, no worries, I'm not worried about it. Go invisible all you want, I'm not worried about it. Okay, it's fine. We're okay. We're fine. Okay, so maybe I need to just flash where he usually is and then don't go over the- <laughs> That's okay. We're doing fine. All right, ghost. It's me and you. There we go. There it is. He's close. He's real close. Freddy is real close. <sighs> My palms are sweaty. We just got to keep our cool. The name of the game, as always, is keep our composure. Got to keep our composure because what Freddy wants is for us to... Follow the voice again, again. She's in the bathroom. <laughs> She's in the bathroom. Light bulb, oh, I need this. Let's just chill here for a second by this light. My gosh, this is intense. Okay, where are you? Where are you, lady? Where are you? I know you're here somewhere. Cool, found you. All right, great. I feel like we're getting close. I've followed this ghost like seven times already. Okay, so she's downstairs. Well, this isn't great. Oh, that light's out now. That's great. This is all just great. This is great. This is fantastic. I'm gonna die from insanity. I gotta book it downstairs. I gotta go straight to the office. All right, we just gotta go. Don't mind me. I'm just gonna make my way to the office real quick. Please, Freddy, be nice to me. Please be nice, Freddy. Okay. It's so dark. I can't see anything, and it's so dark. I'm dead. I'm a dead man. I'm a dead man. There's no light. I'm done for. There's no light. Mm-mm-mm. Fuck! Oh! Please, please. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Cool, oh. cool, cool. All right, cool. Yeah, don't worry about it. I'm in the light now. I'm in the light. Chill out, bro. Cool. Okay. Back to normal. Gosh, I can't see anything. It's so dark, man. It's so dark in this place. 
Hey, man. Brother. Hey, brother. Michael! Get to the light. Is there light in here? There's no light. Everything's red. I can't see. Escape. Oh, okay. Cool. All right. Let me just run. Let me just escape. All right. Let me escape. Out the front door. Yeah? Sounds right. That sounds logical. Let's just go out the front door. Let's go, guys. Come on. Out the front door. Here we go. Here it is. There we go. Let's leave. Let's leave. Can't leave. How do we leave? Oh, my gosh. Please. Okay, I can't go out the front door. How about the door back this way? <gasps> okay, I'm trying. I'm trying to leave. I really am. I'm giving it my best. I'm giving it all that I can give it. Oh, wait. Yep, here we go. This door's open now. I would love to leave, and I would love for this game to end. I would love that, actually, very much. I left, right? I'm out. I'm done. <sighs> you made it. It appears to me that you now realize of what those eyes are capable of. You see their shade. You hear their whispers. Michael, does this look familiar to you? You remember their faces. It's your best friend's favorite bunny. <gasps> bunny. Perhaps maybe even your best friend himself. And you sense them in the dark? That suffocating weight. The chill that crawls beneath your skin. Every shadow is a reminder. Every whisper a prelude to the inevitable. Every breath you take pulls them closer. Now, watch closely, Michael. As the darkness breathes and the shadows awaken. Thank you all so much for joining me for Shadows Awaken. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Hope to see you on the next one. And until then, God bless and take care.